Well, it's been a big weekend in downtown Youngstown. First, the downtown shutdown, and then YSU Summer Festival of the Arts and the St. Nick Greeks Festival. WKBN has been showing you all the sights and sounds from these events. And tonight, 27 First News reporter Christina Mullen tells us how the Greek Festival has changed since it started. The annual Summer Greek Fest at St. Nicholas Greek Orthodox Church has been going on all weekend long. Well, we started off with a little family picnic, and before you knew it, we said, let's try a little festival, and before you know it, it's grown to what you see now. And what helps generate a bigger crowd is the other festivals that are happening in the area, like YSU's Summer Festival of the Arts. And we're always at the same weekend, and now the county and the, the city have joined us with something going on downtown every night. Downtown shutdown was on Friday, then the Wine and Jazz Festival last night, and tonight is the Gospel Fest. It's become the biggest weekend of the year every year. Having all of these festivals on the same weekend not only helps businesses, but changes the image of Youngstown. People come here, get something to eat, they go down to the other event. Or they go to the Festival of Arts, come over here, get something to eat, and go back. So it's, it's crossing back and forth, people enjoying and appreciating what they have right here in Youngstown, Ohio. Although the Greek Summer Fest has changed throughout the years, one thing that everyone says always stays the same is the food. In Youngstown, Christina Mullen, WKBN 27 First News.